Okay, I'm going to be unboxing. I'm going to be unboxing for you. My Rising of the Shield manga. Maybe I'm going to just open up the package real fast. I think it's, it should be Rising of the Shield Volume 1. Alright. Then I'm going to be unboxing for you. Yep, that. That one package today, so. I ordered this from Crunchyroll.com. Yep, from Crunchyroll store. Yep, it came from the Crunchyroll store. They sent me all. They sent me all the. Pa they sent me all the packaging. It is the Rising of the Shield manga volume. It is Rising of the Shield. Manga. Um, but why show you? Why show you that when I can show you that when I can show you this? The Rising of the Shield manga review volume one. The manga was under ten bucks. It costs like seven or eight dollars. And you factor your shipping. I can just look at. I can just look at the receipt. I can just look at the. Re I can just look at this receipt, my love. To see how much they actually charge me for shipping. You know they don't flat. Out, they don't flat out tell me anyway. Uh, you know they don't have it listed. But anyway, anyway, the last time I unboxed a manga was the Neptunia import. It was the Cho Signal game Neptunia imported manga? So. Let's have a look. Let's just have a look and see some of the pages in the Rising of the Shield manga. Now, obviously, this is fully translated. Like, the, it's fully English translated. It's not import like the Neptunia manga, but... There you go. And already, and already... I recognize how much Rising of the Shield. Who has it? It was on the Funimation app in Crunchyroll. You know, it wasn't on TV. It wasn't really aired on TV. Not that I know of. So I know about now for me, my, 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 who's a super bitch, and I know about the queen, and my little sister. I like the anime, but I kind of like that time I got reading cards in the design better. Now, probably I'm not going to show off every page of the manga like I'm doing right now, but that would be absurd. That would take all long. And just kind of like a flip dude. Just kind of like a flip dude and let you get a grand and see what you think of it. No, not really. I just think I'll just like to show off my mangas anyway. You can see that. Hey, look, it's Ratalia. I knew about the Rising of the Shield manga from a manga reading website, but I didn't read it because I didn't want spoilers. Because I was seriously enjoying the anime. I think Mai's. I think Mai's in here. I think he was supposed to be on the first page, but I think Mai. I think Mai was. Mai. Oh, I should call her. Or I should call her bitch and the king is trash. I like it. I like that episode. Or now for me finally get this name cleared. I forget what episode that is. I don't know. I've worried about myself going back. Nah. Now for me finds himself being summoned to another world from the four car hero from Japan. Yeah. It's one of those animes where you get summoned to another world. The trope is kind. Of, the trope is kind of overused. Nah, I just seen page one have my, have my you know super bitch on it, but oh well. Mm. Kind of, forgive me if I'm flipping too fast. Mm. Let's see. I'm trying to see all the other manga. Only manga at the end of it has advertisement for other stuff. For, for other stuff they translate. I guess they have extra stuff in here. The heroes cross. I forget the name of the other heroes, like the shield hero, the bow hero. I know the spear hero has a hair of a has a hair of a woman. Well, most of his party members are girls. These last few pages are blank. They could have used some advertising. I don't know. It's kind of like a lazy, lazy race. It's a print anyway. It's a print on this. It's the last few pages blank anyway. They could have just printed more advertising. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pages. It's a blank pages. Who designed? Who designed? Who designed that for printing? What they want you to do? Put your autograph in here. 
Yep, The Rising of the Shield was based off the original novel that was written by Japanese lady, I forget her name, back in 2013. It was adapted into an anime and then it made into a made into a manga. Okay. I like the cover. I like the cover. It captures the rising of the shield. <laughs> You know, Rise of the Shield didn't actually start off as a manga. You know, it's history. It started off as a as a novel. As a, as a novel. I was just looking at the Rising of the Shield manga to see who who's responsible for this. It's a company called One Piece Books. The manga was translated by a company called One Piece. A company called One Piece Books. Who, who did the official English translation. Other than that. Other than that. Other than that. Okay. Yep, the original story was written by Akira Kiryu. This is printed characters. Most manga, most manga is just, most U.S. manga has most U.S. manga has has advertising art, but this manga didn't really have any. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this unboxing of the Rising of the Shield manga. I got I ordered to Crunchyroll anyway. I don't know. I haven't bought manga to Barnes no, mostly because I don't have ride down there anymore, but oh well. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Until next one. Till next time. See you later.